We are here today to celebrate with Michelle and Chris an important moment in their lives. In the time that they have been together, their love, their understanding of each other has grown, matured, and now they have decided to live their lives together as husband and wife. Guests, you may be seated. Michelle and Chris, it is this day you take a giant step of courage and commitment to love, understand, and grow. And when a commitment this strong is made by two people, the force of that commitment, of that love, and of that courage reaches out and touches all of us around you so that our lives are changed and we share a part of your love. Like a stone dropped in a still pond, the ripples of the love from this celebration extend and change the world we live in. In our long history, we have never discovered a better way of life than a man and woman sharing love together in a lasting and responsible way. For it is in marriage that we meet our deepest human needs for love and companionship for someone with whom we can share in an intimate and trusting way all of our hopes, our joys, and our dreams of life. If it is your intention to be joined together in holy matrimony, please turn, face each other, and join right hands. Now, I'm going to uh, be approaching my 25th year of marriage, and so I'm going to tell you, I'll give you just a little bit of uh, advice. I'll tell you about the uh, silent treatment, okay? A man and his wife were having some problems at home and were giving each other the silent treatment. Suddenly, the man realized the next day he would need his wife to wake him up at 5 a.m. for an early morning business flight, not wanting to be first to break the silence and lose, he wrote on a piece of paper, please wake me at 5 a.m. He left it where he knew she would find it. So the next morning, the husband woke up only to discover it was 9 a.m. and he had missed his flight. Furious, he was about to go and see why his wife hadn't wakened him. When he noticed a small little piece of paper by the bed, it said, it is 5 a.m., wake up. <laughs> Silent treatment, it doesn't always work. You are now taken into your care and keeping the happiness of the one person in all the world whom you love the best. You are adding to your life not only the affection of each other, but also the companionship and blessing of a deep trust as well. You are agreeing to share strength, responsibilities, but most of all to share your loved one for another. And now as you look at one another, do you, Chris, take Michelle to be your wife? Do you promise to love and cherish her? in sickness and in health, in prosperity or adversity, so long as you both shall live. And do you, Michelle, take Chris to be your husband? Do you promise to love and cherish him in sickness and in health, in prosperity or adversity, so long as you both shall live? And now, Chris, if you repeat after me, I, Christopher Nathaniel Tolliver, take you, Michelle Nicole Gomer, to be my wife. I promise to remember what we have discovered in each other, to accept the discoveries and the treasures of growing together. I stand before you in the presence of family and friends as your loving and faithful husband. Michelle, if you repeat after me. I, Michelle Nicole Gomer, take you, Christopher Nathaniel Tolliver, to be my husband. I promise to remember what we have discovered in each other, to accept the discoveries and treasures 
of growing together. I stand before you in the presence of family and friends as your loving and faithful wife. I hold in my hand the rings which are a token of your love and faith that you have in each other. The rings represent a circle, a never-ending circle of love. The rings, an important symbol, are made out of precious metals, diamonds. If you care for them properly, they will last a human lifetime. You've promised to stay together for the rest of your lives. Don't let anything or anyone separate you from each other. Always walk together, side by side, hand in hand, supporting each other. And as your rings are made to last a lifetime, so is your love one for another. May these rings serve as a daily reminder of the vows that you shared with each other here today. As you continue holding her ring hand, Chris, looking into the eyes of your beautiful bride, with all the love that you have in your heart for her, say, with this ring, I take you to be my wife. I promise to love you and only you. I promise to protect you, comfort you, to always be your best friend. And I promise from this day forward, you will never walk alone. Repeat up to me with this ring. I take you to be my husband. I promise to love you and only you. I promise to protect you, to comfort you, to always be your best friend. And I promise from this day forward, you will never walk alone. Today, I married my best friend, our bond complete, it hath no end. We share one soul, we share one heart, a perfect time, a perfect start. With these rings we share together, love so close to last forever. This special day, two special hearts, let nothing keep this love apart. For as much as Michelle and Chris have consented together in this marriage ceremony, having been witnessed this day and by the authority given unto me by the state of California, I hereby declare that on the third day of November in the year 2012, Chris and Michelle became husband and wife. Chris, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> 